going on guys Alric Phoenix here and I'm super excited to bring you to you today my tips on how to rank up really fast in Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Now, I know the game isn't out yet but what you may not be aware is that Treyarch turned on the multiplayer servers uh, two days ago uh, a lot of YouTubers have been uh, going online and playing a lot of multiplayer because uh, <laughs> a lot of us got the game early and uh, I can't really talk about any of the multiplayer gameplay itself. I can't upload anything until the game officially comes out Monday at midnight. But this is about gaining XP really, really fast and ranking up and prestiging as fast as possible. And because this is all public information, I can totally talk about it. It's going to be really awesome. So uh, let's get right into the class video and boop. Here's, uh, here's the class that I'm recommending for people that are average players. I say average because not ev this. my previous class was for the noobs, the people that are really new at the game, have probably less than 1kd, and maybe go negative quite a bit, but really still enjoy the game. This class is for those of you that are a 1.5-ish kd, 1.2, 1.3, 1.8. This is the class for you if your sole initial objective is to gain experience and prestige as absolutely fast as possible. So first of all, this is for Kill Confirmed. Yes, Kill Confirmed is the game mode that you are going to want to play to rank up fast. Why? Each tag is worth 100 points. Each deny is 50 points. Each kill is 50 points. There is no other game mode that gives you the sheer amount of point ability without having to sit on a flag somewhere. And this class is absolutely designed to take full, full advantage of Kill Confirmed and to get you the most amount of points possible. Uh, right off the bat, I'm going to talk about uh, the guns. You are going to want to be switching guns. Uh, David Vonderhaar tweeted out that the fastest way to gain experience above all else is to rank up your guns and do the gun challenges. So though I put the MP7 up here with the suppressor and rapid fire attachments, you're going to be changing attachments constantly. You're going to be changing your SMG every couple games so that way you get hit these levels, get these challenges as fast as possible. You will race through the prestige in probably five hours faster than everyone else. So, though I picked an SMG, you can use any SMG, you don't have to use the MP7. Uh, for the perks, the goal for this is to collect tags as fast as possible and get kills as fast as possible. So we're going with lightweight to make you move faster, uh, hardline, so that way you get your score streaks as fast as possible from picking up these tags, scavenger, so that way you don't run out of ammo and you don't have to worry about trying to pick up another gun, and extreme conditioning, which will as with the other Call of Duties, double your sprint distance. Uh, I chose the sensor grenade because that is the portable radar from Modern Warfare 3. It's the same thing. Throw it down and it uh, finds where the enemies are in relation to that grenade. Uh, for, for the secondary, I did choose the executioner. The, the executioner is actually a super cool, cool little gun. It is, though it is marked as a pistol, it behaves exactly like a shotgun. You will shoot it and it has the same damage and spread. It is literally shooting shotgun shells. Where it falls short is its range. It has z like no range. They have to be right in front of you. It is kind of like the AA-12 from MW3. But it, that's why it's there as the secondary. MP7 for some range and the executioner for anything long, short distance, really close encounters. Because you're going to be up in a lot of people's faces because you, your goal is to get kill confirm tags as fast as possible. Uh, for your perks, it, it, or not perks, uh, kill streaks, we're going to go with UAV, Hunter Killer Drone, and Hellstorm Missile. Now, let me talk about this for a moment. Though these are not super high kill kill streaks, which is the point for the average people, the people that are, you know, less than 1.5 KD, the UAV, you get, someone will get the kill while that is up, you will immediately get 10 10 XP and 10 points towards your next kill streak. The Hunter Killer drone will be thrown out. You'll get 100 XP for throwing it out. As well, the second it gets a kill, you get 25 XP 
and 25 points towards your score streak if it's a single kill. Now the Hellstorm missile. I picked this over a lot of the others because what a lot of people don't know is not all the high and multi-kill kill streaks give you the same amount of score and XP. However, the ones that give you the highest amount, one of them is the Hellstorm missile. Each kill is 25 score and 25 XP, unlike, say, dogs, which only gives you 15. So this is the class that you will absolutely use and will guarantee to get you to rank 55 in less than probably 30 hours. Sorry, less than 13 hours, because you will be collecting tags at a rate that no one has seen. Uh, anyways, that's it. Uh, tomorrow will be my final class video for the people that are the pub stompers. Uh, this is Alric Phoenix. Uh, I it took a little work to do this video, so if, if you could leave me some love down below, give me a like, give me a comment, uh, maybe subscribe if you want. Your call. Uh, this is Alric Phoenix, signing out, guys. Bye.